Well, ladies and gentlemen, Linux for Life here with Feed the Beast. Let's play. Um, I already recorded episode 5, but we're going to re record episode 5 because the recording I have is absolute fucking garbage, to say it nicely. Um, so I did a few things off camera, considering that. Let's get some more truck over there. Um, so they've added in Minecraft pack and all the other packs have updated to 1.4.7. Um, Minecraft pack has added a new mod called Bibliocraft. And so these are some shelves here. This is a, like a tool holder thing. Um, let's go. Yeah. Let's see. Where do we see it? I think it's page. Here we go. Uh, you probably can't really see this very well, but that's all right. That's a. Uh, let's change the GUI options here. Let's go to large. Uh, now we should be able to see it a little better. <laughs> um. So we have armor stand, which we haven't made yet. We can make that. Uh, there's bookshelves, and with these bookcases, you can actually put books into them. Um, I don't have books to put in them right now, so I'm not going to do that. Um, you got oak shelves and all the different wood shelves. Then uh, you got these uh, potion shelves, which is kind of cool. And then you got these lined oak cases and jungle wood cases. And oh, oh, phrase. Oh, Jesus. Hello. Um. Any I stop freaking the hell out. Why are you freaking out? Why are you freaking out? All right. Doesn't want to tell you what these. Oh, I see. I see what's going on. Hold on. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, Fraps was open right there in that corner, and it because Fraps is was set to be on default on top. It just was there, not really, but there. But yeah. And so then you got these wooden labels and birch tool, or, you know, the tool racks. Um, I put a label here. I'm just not really sure how to use now. Use the label. Hmm. And I, I've tried like everything to put something in the label. Not sure. Um, but these cases, that's a case right there. I put a brain in it. Um, you just got to shift click to open the door. And maybe because I have something in my hand. Yeah. All right. So see, you got the brain in there. Uh, just like a pitch frame. You just put the B right there like that. That's it. And you're going to shut the door. That's cool. Um, so you got this desk. It will look like that. That's cool. And you put a book and quill there. Make it look like you're writing something. Um, I, And then you can also put them over here. And it'll kind of stack them on the sides, which is kind of cool. So some decorative stuff. That's, you know, that was basically it, the mod. Um... What else did it add? I believe added a tape measure. So what's that? Iron and what's a real string? Any dandelion? Okay. Well, let's make it. Why not? Sure. Let's get some. Let's get a dandelion. Thank you. Um. So as you can see, I've been getting some cactus going. It goes all the way down there. Um, so we can get some waterproof pipes and stuff like that eventually here. So we can actually get into some stuff other than me walking around and derping around. Um, so, and then what was it? Iron. 
four pieces of iron. And we're going to go. Now. So let's go, let's say from here to there. Seven blocks. So that's kind of cool. You can just measure stuff out now. Seven blocks. So let's see. Our house is seven. But, oops. 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 Let's go there. By seven. Of course it is, because I made it. <laughs> but so that's kind of a nifty thing. Um, just put it on our shelf. There we go. Shelves are kind of derpy. Uh, it doesn't quite line up with the tools. It would be kind of nice if they were shifted down a little bit. Um, same thing with these tool frames. It's the top tools stick out a little bit, but that's all right. You know, a few little minor details. Not nothing huge. Um. So that, uh, the episode that ow, 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 that we won't discuss, um, I had basically set this turtle up, dug down a little bit, still got a little bit more to go, not much, yeah, a little bit more, um, but I need to give him some fuel, he's out of fuel, and uh, I'm out of place to put cobble right this second, so that being said, that part, that's kind of on hold, I just, I needed the sand, um, I want to melt it, uh, smelt it down into glass, um, so we can actually get, I'm going to get started working on a new project. Um, that's the plan with that. Um, so DJ, Pimp Daddy, was kind enough and gave us a jetpack. So that's kind of cool. Um, he also gave us some long fall boots with our jetpack. I guess he was sick of watching me just kind of fumble around. Um, but we're going to take a ride over to the island. Another island in the uh, Twilight Island. I've been working on those a little bit. Let's, uh, let's just take a quick nap. Why not? Make it day. Make it day. Let's hit our mower. So I planted three of these canopy trees over here, um, and they've grown, as you can see. Um, there's a one of those black totem pole things from the twilight, or you can find them in this world too, I think. But I got it from twilight, anyways. Um, and I brought over some reindeer, three of them. Um, I, 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 I don't know. He just keeps roaming away. I bring him back. He goes back. So I just let him do his own thing. There is a boar, uh, boar over here. He's just hanging out. He must have walked down, and now he can't figure out how the hell to get back up. Like a genius. Um, but the island I spent the most time over here on the nether island. Uh, I still need... I'm going to, like... Oh, 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 on these edges here, I'm going to replace that with, um, oh, shut up, with uh, soul sand. And then in here is going to be soul sand. Um, that's why it's like that. I just go to get some soul sand. I just haven't got to the nether yet. Um, but got all this nether rack done. Got the portal nicely dressed. Um, went crazy with some uh, micro blocking. As you can see, it's all micro blocks here and these are corners nice corner ow um let's see these are all just micro block covers so that's how i did that and it came out pretty good i think got a nice little kind of walkway up into it that you kind of kind of blends in a little bit nicely so it's not too harsh on the eyes. Whoops, I don't want to go there. <laughs> Alright, um, so that's that pretty much. Um, that's what I've been up to. Um, just, I think I planted a few more rubber trees since last time. Um, just been going and 
as carrots and stuff grow, feeding the pigs. Um, haven't really maintained sheep. Um, but the uh, next project we're going to start working on here is going to be... Um, we're going to actually start using some farm farm block stuff. Um, so these multi-farm blocks here, um, we're going to get into. But what I want to do is I want to build like a greenhouse kind of looking thing to store our stuff in. Two things. The greenhouse will keep them safe. Hopefully, from mobs and touch, we can plan all that way. And I think it's just kind of cool to, you know, to give us a thing to do. Oops. Um, but the other thing I thought of is the way the multi-farm blocks work is, let's see here. Let's get a block. Uh, let's just use sand. I don't know. Um, and... I'm just going by rough memory here. I don't don't quote me on this yet. <laughs> but uh, I think it's, yeah, it's three by three. Um, and then I believe it's one, two, three, four, five. I think so. I think it goes out five. So it goes out five each side, and then just kind of tapers in here uh, it doesn't do a square it's kind of a awkward shape but uh no maybe it does a square yeah I think it does square so I believe it's five out from the center could be four I think it's five though um yeah I think it's five <laughs> just trying to remember what I, I was doing some testing with in the creative map and I just can't remember exactly what it was but I, th I believe it's five um, so I I think what I should do here is one, two three four five is um kind of build the farm first and then we know how we have to do it. I um, think that's going to be the best way. Because I, I was thinking if I had just built the greenhouse first. And then do the multi. But then I'm going to run into the issue if I don't do it exactly right. Um, with the farm. So that being said. I'm going to have to work on that. Um, and the reason I don't want to use these farms, um, is because they are being taken out. So, um, I don't know exactly when, I don't know if it's 1.6 update or what I thought it was going to be this up, this update, but they're still in the game. So, um, <laughs> oh, fucking thanks. these please stack. God dang, man. Oh, none of these stack. Well, I don't know exactly what's up with these forest drones. Um, I just started. Oh, Jesus, started breeding some of these forest drones. Um, I'm gonna get into bee breeding here very soon too. Uh, that's the other project I've been kind of working on off camera is just trying to get like. Right now, I have a stack of sixty-four plus four. Meadow drones. Um, so now I'm just working on some forced um, bees. Um, we should do is uh, I don't have a scoop. Do I not have a scoop? I don't have a scoop. Yes, I don't. So let's take a block. Oh, oh. Uh, no, you can go back on the stand. Thank you. I didn't really want you. I know that's mean, but portal gun, I don't want you right now. I'm just afraid if I bring it anywhere, I'm going to lose the damn thing. Um, when I was previously recording episode five, first take, that was awful. I uh, 
So one of these beehives, these uh, tropical beehives. And we need the tropical beehives because they give you silky combs. And... Oops. Hey. Oh, what the heck? What the hell? There we go. Um, they give you these silky propolis. So then you get from the silky comb. And then... Um, then when you centrifuge it, it gives you a chance, a 60% chance of a silky wisp and a 10% uh, chance of propolis. Um, but the silky wisp is what you need to make the woven silk in a carpenter. And to make the uh, apiarist suit, you need the uh, woven silk, excuse me. Um, and this is, you definitely need the, you don't need these, the, the suit for these nice bees but as you get deeper and deeper into the bee stuff you're gonna need it for some of the more dangerous bees um, including these uh, these tropical bees if you stand in their their block area I, I don't remember exactly what size their block area is um, you will get poisoned by them I know if I knew where I found that dang thing the search is, it was just like hanging in midair. That's what prompted me to, to even see it because it was just like hanging in midair between two trees. And I'm not seeing it. And it may have been like a thing of a tree I cut down and I didn't realize it was up towards the top of its tree. But now I don't see it. Go figure. I want to find it. You can't find it. But I need some. So let's find some. Let's get the hunt on. Um, hopefully I don't run out of JPEG. I'm using an awful lot of it just to fly around here. The heck did I see that damn thing? I mean, I could easily go back and watch the other video, but that would be a little tough right now because I'm recording. I'd have to stop, and it would be a pain in the ass. Jetpack, half. All right, so we got to be careful here. Use treetops when we can. Uh Oh, where, oh, where will you be? It's becoming nighttime again. I swear to God, every time I fucking turn around in this game, it's nighttime again. Um, I really wish I knew who that one was. Well, anyways. I'm going to spend half an episode here. Just searching for the damn bee. I saw that when I saw it. So it's got to be... In this area. Yeah, you know? Maybe? Aha, uh -huh, there it is. I knew it was just floating in mid air. Ow. Oh, it gives me a valiant princess <laughs> and a tropical drone. Oh, good Christ. So, um, hives have a chance to drop in a valiant princess. I don't know if I've had one drop before on camera. Um, and they're, they're a good bee to have, but it kind of sucks because now, like, I got a drone without a queen, so, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
All right. Well, I'm going to stop looking for those because uh, I can do that off camera and not bore you guys to fucking death. So let's take a quick commercial break. Um, and once we come back, we will be, I'll be prepared to do actually some actual work here. So see you guys in a little bit. All right, guys, uh, welcome back. I'm actually making my way over to DJ Pimp Daddy's house. Um, I'm going to give you guys a little tour of that. But I found one of these wisp things, and I kind of want to go check out the chest. But the asshole of a wisp spawned fairly quickly here. So let's see if we can do this without dying. Oh, boy. Anything good? Ow, ow, ow. Sorry. Sorry. Um, it's said fast drone, but... Oh, fuck. Ow. Ron. Poof. All right. Leave him alone. Um, so I'm just going to continue my trek towards DJ's house. Um, that way I can show you guys what uh, he's been up to over here with um, oh. with Kane Anders, which is his uh, brother. So they've been kind of working on a project together over here. So, uh. I will bring you guys right back once I'm closer because I'm still like 4,000 blocks away. All right, we're coming up on one of those, another one of those wisps things. Um, and check it out. Hopefully, get over here before anything goddamn spawns. Oh, we'll take the ruby, sure. Yeah, sure. The hoe. Why not? Oh! <gasps> You're back! Where'd you, where'd you go off hiding? Come on, buddy. Let's make the trick. Come on. All right. And we'll be back if anything else exciting happens. Oh, we're still about 1,300 blocks away from uh, DJ's place. But I see this village coming up. So I figured, hey, what the hell. Bring you guys in on for the village ride here. See what we got at this village. I just I, I took my jetpack off for now so I can conserve some of the fuel when I really need it. Hold on, bees. I need to get these bees. Uh, my dogs, once again, I had to cross a huge body of water to get over to the desert and then over to here. Um, Unfortunately, the dog did not teleport once I got to land. Um, so once again, he is lost. You never know. Land. So, that be that, I guess. Um, oops. Ah! Move your Baha'i ass. Let's see here. What we got besides a broken village? Anything up here? Nope, oh, not that one. Definitely a broken village. <laughs> but what else is new in Minecraft? And some zombies. Yeah, somebody's definitely been here before. Oh, let's take those iron leggings. Ours are almost dead. So, let's leave those boots for somebody else. Why not? Fire charge. Sure, I'll take that. Leave the dandelion. Somebody else definitely already been here, though. <laughs> uh, there's no question of that. Uh, hmm. Interesting. All right, uh, I'm gonna continue on. Once again, see you guys in a second. Well, we are about 800 blocks away, and I found one of these things. 
Um, sounds dangerous. I don't have anything to break it down the bears with. That's gonna take way too long. Shit's gonna spawn like crazy, you know? Um, should be already spawned like crazy, you know? Just even get in there before wisp spawn, because I know wisp spawn in these damn things too. Oh, da -da 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 -da. I have managed to drop all the cobble that I brought with me. I guess we're gonna make it out of wood. Ain't gonna be much help, but a little, I guess. It's better than none. Ah, that's not too bad. Now. I wanna. Oh, ow. I should do. Put that on. Oh. I don't know if they're actually dying when they hit the ground down there. Holy smokes! Oh, Jesus. Cobble, 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 cobble now. Cobble now! Oh my shit, Lord, drop something. I'll pick you up in a minute, don't worry. I fuck out of my inventory. Pick that back up. Ow. I get down here. Holy lordy lord. I'm quite honestly shocked that there's no ow wisp spawning it. I gotta really get this ow spawner dead though. Oh. Really? I was just about to break the damn thing! Thank you. You can keep fighting each other down there, thank you. Don't worry what I'm doing. Um, no. It, it would probably be very unwise to get, go down straight- Ow! Straight down in there. Um, so that's gonna be a problem. Sure, there we go. There we go. Yeah, fight each other. There you go. There we go. Come on. One at a time. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Who's going to win? <laughs> Ow. Hey, somebody dropped an iron ingot. Pick it up. All right, we got some oh, some gold. Let's uh, drop that sand. Right, go with flesh. Nothing useful. Smite. Let's take the tin. Uh, running out of spot to put stuff. Mm, saddle we don't really need right now. Zombie flesh in there. Oh, compass would be nice. Yeah, not gonna do much of anything, to be honest. Yeah, silver side saddle. Eh, eh, eh. Really wasn't worth the time and effort. Alright guys, uh, I'm going to continue my trek to DJ's house. See you guys in a minute. Alright guys, um, we are just uh, basically here. Um, I found, I got some two dogs. I figured I had some bones on me, so I said, eh, what the hell. Um, so, let's check DJ's place out, shall we? Here's a large quarry going. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. yeah, they're getting a little further than they were last time I was over here. They got that, I guess, to go up and down with. I don't know, maybe, nope, nope, uh, nope, no, they got a lot further than last time I was here. Holy smokes. Um, whoa. Wow. What the hell that is? Um. Jays. Jays. Dogs are going to die. <laughs> Sorry to say, but man, dog, you are in the bad spot. Little pool of lava must have been. Oh, little house. Bet. What the hell was that? Safety bin. Skelly and zombie. Oh. Okay, I know, I know what they got going on. No jetpack use inside, dumbass. Yeah, so this is quicksand. What they're doing is they're having the spawners drop actually right through the quicksand. And it kills them. Oh, fuck, that's loud. But yeah, it kills them. So the spawners are up here. Um, if I do this, I'm not going to have any way. Uh, let's just... Seeds. Oops. I don't know. I just don't want to fall in there. So you can see the spawner there. And holy smokes, is that loud. Let me get a couple pieces of cobble to fix it. Alright. Cool. Coolio to do. Oh my god, stop. Alright, let's get that back. See. See if we can see any diamonds real quick. See if they missed any. I'm trying to fly around too much because I have no jetpack left. Eh, looks like they got most of it. Uh, so let's go upstairs. Let's go up into his house and see what he's been doing up here. Oh, leg. That's uh. <gasps> oh, jeez. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Um, I have long full boots on. What just happened? I'm not sure how I took damage when I hit the wall like that, but that's right. It was like that was like I brushed it and took damage. Uh, that was weird. All right, let's see if he has a way to get in his house without a jetpack. Jetpack just died at the last second. That sucks. So close. Long way up. I know this episode's a little long, but that's alright. Um Yeah, alright, cool. Um I haven't had we didn't have any episodes last week due to episode five being a washout and um and then over the weekend I actually I got sick over the weekend. That's, there was no podcast either. Uh no episode two this weekend because I was sick. Yeah, as a fucking dog. So, all right, let's see here. So, looks like they got like this thing going here lava storage. Um, buddy, you'd be out of lava. So, I'm guessing these are the magma. Yep, all right. So, he was making that. Hmm. Cool. Um,. Oh, that's obviously their, their genius. It's water. Huh, yeah. Hmm. So what he's got? Yep, accumulated. So what's this tank going to be? This is looks like oil. Crude oil, yep. Alright, so like, this is, I guess is this going to be his tank area or something like that? This bottom floor. Oh, these are all his machines. So it's, it's kind of cool that he's got them all like spread out. Um, 
He's got them all labeled and stuff too. Which is kind of cool. Let's see. Do you have a uh, charging station? Cool, dude. DJ safe. Let's go to safes. Fud. <laughs> Charcoal? I guess so. You got none making there, buddy, though. So you got some electric furnaces, compressor, macerators, two of them. Uh, plate bending machine, which is new. And canning machine. Oh, yeah, with the Greg Tech Pock, um, they did update a few things in it. Uh, some of the recipes are easier. Uh, some of the solar panels and stuff are easier to make now. Um, not as quite as hard. Um, but they've also added pl plate bending. Um, so now you just... Uh, plate's not apparently showing up. But uh, you got tin and a plate. And some of this might be texture pack issues here. Um, not sure. Yeah, so this is all is texture packs that are missing. Um, so gonna have to try to work on that, I guess. Yeah, these are all the new stuff, and plate bending machine is just a solid. Yeah, so this is that's texture pack missing stuff. Um, so we'll have to work on that. Uh, industrial blast furnace, industrial electrolyzer. Alloy furnace, blast furnace. It's pretty much got every all the machines on this level. And let's go up to the last level. Oh, nice, nice little nether room. Leo's. Somebody's bedroom. I believe this is DJ's bedroom, he said. This is their little thermal craft room. Book shit. There's books in there, but that's sugar cane there, buddy. That's not books. I mean, yeah. This is um, Kane Anders' bedroom. I took, I didn't take my shoes off. I just walked on his bed. That's right. And we're going to go up. And they have this little tree farm. Ah, they have one of these Steve carts somewhere here. Um, yep, yeah, right there. getting kind of full. Eh, not too bad, I guess. Um, you just got a wheat farm down there. Another tree farm over there. Um, Steve cart thing, uh, which we call it. Jamin's into big time, so we can, when he's got some good size farms, two of them, I think, uh, we can show you next time. Uh, did I miss the storage level? Yeah, so this is all the storage stuff. Wow, he's got some amber. Jesus. He's got a magma cream. Yeah. 14 furnaces, in case you need a few. <laughs> got some cobble. That would be for sure. Good Christ. Building up his scrap. It's always nice. More cobble. Hmm. More random junk. Uh, let's go down, 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 down. Let's go here. Let's cook our steak. So we can enjoy it. Um, and I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Uh, we've been going on for quite a while now. Um, God dang it. Um, but, um, so, 
put this charcoal in here for you, DJ. So, guys, uh, till next time, I uh, will see you.